Yo guys, this is Sour Pro on here with a uh, strategy video on how to get a good start on the walls PvP. Um, it basically is you have 15 minutes to click resources, and once that 15 minutes is up, walls the walls will drop, and you have to kill everyone on the other three teams. So I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you later. Yo guys, this is Harpo, and I'm here with the Walls of PvP video. This is my starting strategy. I find it very effective. And lagging today, dude. Alright, alright, alright. Whoa. Okay. Oh god. Um. If you can, grab anything in the chests. I didn't get anything. That's, 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 that's quite poop. Um, starter kits, Grandpa or Stark. Stark gives you some wolves. This gives you a knockback stick with... Uh, a stick with knockback three. <laughs> um, but start out, get three pieces of wood. You'll see why. You need to be very quick. Because you want to get this wood, you want to get a wooden pick, and then you want to quickly get a stone pick. And then you want to get your iron. Make eight sticks. Crafting table, you'll have four left over. Now make a wooden pick. Always keep a crafting table on you. It's very important. You don't want to lose it. Alright, now find a cave. You can dig down, but it's better just to... Sprint thing. It's better just to find a cave opening. <sighs> huh. You seem to have been... Oh, there it is. Alright, there's one. Look for something like this. Then grab three stone. All right. You want to get his, you want to get uh, iron. Don't grab like all that you see. Just grab twenty nine iron. That's the magic number. And some coal. About four coal. Cause coal, one coal smelts eight things, or eight ore. And four, that's 32, so that's just enough for the 29. Let's start grabbing. Nine. Uh, epic jump. 29, 29. I don't know how much I have. Four. Don't need to keep that book, it's worthless. Okay, this was a very bad cave. Eight, that's enough for a chest. One. Chest and sword. Or chest and some boots now. Yeah, this was a not a very good cave. Okay, good, there's more. Oh, 16, 16. That's not enough. Cave was worthless. Okay, find another cave if that one fails. All right, some kid already went in here, but that's okay. Just YOLO it, jump down. And, oh god! Okay, maybe not that far. It's that room. Uh, if you see anything like this, you want to go in because there's usually some good looties. Looties, loots in it. Watch out for the pressure plates. Ooh, that's good. For all that. There's usually nothing in these suspensors. There's a lava thing. Make a bucket. Uh, we didn't get much. Some arrows. And a bow, which is good. But, you just want your 29 iron. We got a full set. This one. Full set plus a sword. This one. Just need two more. Two 
two more iron, two more iron, two more iron. This hard and two hours. That's good. There we got you 29. Now, basically just find somewhere safe where you don't think anyone can get to you. You can do it in here if you want. Well, no, don't do it in there. Do it, do it kind of out in the open like this. You're still secluded. And if someone does come near you, then eh, sure it's fine. All right, crafting table. Have enough for two furnaces? No. Oink oink. Uh, split up your coal. Split up the iron. All right. While that's cooking, you still have these two picks. Waste them all gathering cobble. You're gonna need blocks. This is another just another good way to pass time while those things are smelting. All right, now you, oh, there it goes. You finished up with that. I got about almost two stacks of cobble and the iron would be done. It is done. There we go. So now we're gonna make iron pick, iron sword. Just enough for the iron chest, iron, oops, iron legs. Iron helmet and booties. Oink, oink, oink. You're good. If you're gonna rush. Uh, this is the way to do it. I'm gonna show you. Uh, you don't want to go for the center because that's where everyone's gonna be, and you're just gonna die in this bunch of skeletons. Uh, go for the four little. Um, there are four little uh, cube-looking things. There's one diamond in each of those. Go to two of them. Take the iron or diamonds out of those, and you should. Have, and that'll be enough for a diamond sword. You'll be all good. I would suggest get elevated. You can kind of jump up. Make a little platform. Get ready. Ball's gonna drop. Get down, get down. Destroy this. Don't see anyone. Get in, get in. Okay, there's a guy right there. Alright, got two diamonds. Now run. Perfectly back to your spawn. That way you're furthest away from everyone. And if someone is chasing you, you do have a good chance of fighting them. So that you will have to fight them. But if not, try and lose them. You also have the wolves, remember? Because if you get hit, the wolves will go after whatever is trying to kill you. Like that. Okay, no one's chasing. No one's chasing. Alright. The center goes boom. Such an idiot. What an awesome. 
I don't have any raw fish. You gotta eat. So yeah, dog, yeah, you get it. So yeah, that's that. You got your two diamonds, you got your stick on standby, lay on your crafting table, and make your damn mom sword. And you can go ahead and put this on the bar, just in case you drop your sword, because that, that it does happen. Uh, it's very sad, it sucks, but happens. Sometimes you hit Q. Skeleton shooting at me. Oh god, getting lag. So now I don't know where my team is. But that's how you do that. That's how you rush. Quickly get in, get out with your two diamonds. You have your sword. And there's going to be other people, probably with some diamond armor, but it's okay. Uh, I'm not planning on winning this game, so I'm just going to go rush, see what I can do. Just for fun. It's only starting strategy that I'm showing you, not everything else. Oh god, like that. I'm so used to being on team 2 that I see yellow and I think that's me. So, yeah. Those walls. You don't fail like that, of course not, but that was my starting strategy, that's how I do it. Um, if I remember I'm on team 4, I would have killed him. Or at least had a chance to. But whatever. He killed my dogs. Whatever. So yeah, that's it. There's a guy over there. A guy over there. Oh, that's a villager. Whatever. But yeah, hope you enjoyed. And I'll be seeing y'all later. Bye. Yeah, <laughs> he fell. <laughs> Creeper fan one. <laughs> everyone. I can't find a way out. Hmm. They're just gonna kick you. Kick you. Oh. Oh well.